Hi, this is Michael from GeekZoneHosting.com, and today we're going to learn how to edit your menu. Hello, this is Michael from GeekZoneHosting.com, and today we're going to learn how to edit your menu. So you should have received your login information. And when you go, you will go to MediterraneanKitchens.net forward slash fix it and log in. You should see this screen as you're logging in. And then you will go down and put your username and your password into that box and you will be able to log in. Now, once you've gotten logged in, you'll click on the Pages, and then click on All Pages. This will give you your list of pages available to edit. You're going to want to scroll down to where it says Home, and then click on the Edit with Elementor. That will allow you to edit the information on the Home page which includes all of your menus. And give it a moment to load. Once it loads, you'll be able to uh, edit any content that you can select. Uh, for now, we're going to edit the prices for the uh, Bellevue dinner menu. As you can see, you can click on any of these that you want to and it will uh, display the information and allow you to edit it. Over on the right, on the left hand side, you'll see some tabs. So, what you want to do is select the tab that you want to edit. So, you'll do the uh, Bellevue dinner menu. You'll click that. Um, make sure you click it. Nice, uh, nice, and, nice and good there. Otherwise, nothing will update. So, we'll go ahead and click it. And there you go. You have two places that you can edit the information. In the box below where your uh, cursor is, you'll see that you can edit that information there directly. Or you come over here and you can edit uh, the information this way. You just click where you want to start editing. And then use your backspace key or type in a new price anything that you might need to do for this particular spot. As we'll change it here, uh, let's see what's on the menu. Okay, it looks like you changed the price on this chicken shawarma uh, to $19.95. So we'll go ahead and type that in. And then You'll notice there's a green button down there that says Update. So you'll click on that Update button, and that's going to save your changes to the website. And right now, the public, once that uh, button turns gray, it means it's been saved. So you're all done there. Uh, so now you can go and edit anything else that you might need to by clicking the other tabs on the left or um, you can click uh, on the uh, menu tab inside the page. Two places that you can edit it. You can edit any of the, the information there if you need to change the copy and change whatever it says, um, in case you change your ingredients or something. 
and then uh, so you can click on any of the other tabs over there it'll display that menu and you go in and you can edit it to do anything you need to and um, so when you're done doing your edits uh, you'll notice that gray that's grayed out so that means it's been saved um, so now you're done and you want to come up and you want to stop editing so you uh, go up to the top of the screen um, just trying to figure out why my screen isn't updating there um, sometimes you might need to refresh the screen a little bit get it to go down click up there okay there we go so yeah so click on the uh, little menu drop down there and go and click on exit the dashboard and click on the blue button give it a moment to update itself and then just uh, click that away and go over to the update button there one last time to make sure everything's updated and saved and there you go you are updated As you can see, the change to the pricing is now live to the public. It was live when you clicked update earlier, uh, but this is just verification that it is indeed live. And when you're done editing, go up to there and click on log out. And it'll take you back to the login page and you're done editing. That's that simple. If you have any questions, give me a call at 206-909-0361. Or email me at geekzonehostingllc at gmail.com. I'm more than happy to help. Have a great day. Bye-bye.